Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Plant Based Storm. I'm Stormy, and this is a place where I love to share about eating a high carb, low fat, whole food, plant based diet, and all of the tips, tricks, and recipes that I use, plus everything related to eating a plant based diet and maintaining it as a lifestyle. It has helped me lose 80 pounds, and I get super excited to talk about this. And today I have a really special episode because I am sharing a book review, actually, too. One has already come out and the other is available for pre-order so let's just jump right in and see how fantastic these books are but before we do that I want to go ahead and say that I'm doing a challenge on Instagram if you're not following me there be sure to check me out at plant based storm um, I share a lot of um, tips and uh, recipes and things like that that I don't necessarily share on my YouTube channel but I'm doing a challenge for the holidays is hashtag PBS healthy holiday challenge so the idea of this is to um, tag me and hashtag your post on instagram and i'm going to be resharing these on my stories throughout the holiday season through the end of december to help hold each other accountable and to have a healthy holiday so many people gain one to five pounds of unhealthy weight over the holidays and then do not go on to lose it so let's have a healthy holiday this season and keep each other accountable. I'm excited about this challenge. If you're not following me, check me out again at Plant Based Storm on Instagram and let's do this, guys. So, today's book review is going to be the How Not to Diet book by Dr. Greger and its companion book, How Not to Diet Cookbook. I'm super excited to share both of these with you. And I wanna say a big thank you to Mary at nutritionfacts.org and to nutritionfacts.org itself for sending me these gifts to share with y'all. Um, the How Not to Diet book is already available for purchase. The How Not to Diet Cookbook is available for pre-order and I believe it's released December 8th. I'll put a link in the description box below. So if you're interested in either one of these books that you can purchase these, I have no affiliation with them. They're just really awesome books and I think it's something that y'all should know about. This book is also a perfect Christmas gift if you are looking for something for a family member or friend that is interested in living a whole food plant-based lifestyle or somebody that is already living a whole food plant-based lifestyle and looking for some more information. Um, this would be a great gift. So I just thought I might drop that in there um, because uh, sometimes finding gifts like that for people can be difficult, but you could give the gift of health and what could be better than that. Also, whenever you go to nutritionfacts.org, they are a wealth of information in and of itself on the website. Um, they do all kinds of videos and have articles and links and references and all of the information that you could ever want to dream and hope and know about a whole food plant-based diet can be found at nutritionfacts.org. They have a free PDF quick start guide and I will add a link to that below as well so that if you are interested in that you can go get that quick start guide um, if leading a whole food plant based diet is something you've been wanting to do and you just don't really know where to start this is a great place to do that. I've already said this book is chock full of information, but y'all, I'm so not kidding. There is over 4,000 cited references, and he makes it easy for you to check it out. In the back of the book, he has a um, reference uh, QR code that you can use to just look it up. Everything is hyperlinked, and you can check out all the references that for yourself and see exactly where these um, studies came from and how they were done. And so he didn't hold anything back with that, which is really awesome. He has sort of created a standard that we can compare all of our diets to and make sure that we are um, eating the most healthy diet as possible to help us lose weight, which is really awesome. Something that we've been needing for a long time because there's so much information out there. You don't know where it's coming from, who it's coming from. It just um, is whatever suits um, the person that is 
giving you that information. A lot of times, some of times the studies are questionably funded and um, it's just really nice and refreshing to have a cohesive book that gives you a standard and the what to do, how to do it, why it happens kind of answers all in one. It is so comprehensive that I think it will be very interesting to you and will serve you for a long time. It's broken down really well. He goes through the problems um, initially and talks about how it causes a variety of our leading um, health problems like diabetes, obesity, uh, autoimmune diseases, so many different things, so many different topics are covered and how we uh, as a modern society try to treat that, the failures of those treatments and what we can actually do about it in order to avoid that scenario or even reverse some things. So that's really interesting right there. It talks about how uh, the modern solutions fail us a lot of times. They just accelerate the problem or they put a band-aid on it and never get to the root cause. And his book shows you how to get to the root cause and change so many different things, including your weight loss and a lot of other health problems can resolve just from eating a healthful whole food plant-based diet, which is really awesome. And you can think of this as kind of a blueprint, uh, if you will. Um, if you are a need to know why and how kind of person, like I love to know the science behind things, then this book is definitely for you, but it's also for people who just want to know how. So either way, I think that you would enjoy this book because it is just a wealth of information, knowledge, and um, practical guidance to the how. And that is so important because, I mean, it's not going to do us any good if we don't know how to use this information. Then he goes into details about the uh, different ingredients, what the types of foods are that are going to be best for weight loss. He shows you how to start the diet, how to optimize it, and then use tips, tricks, and tweaks in order to get the most out of it. Um, and he, he talks about planting yourself, so that is starting your whole food plant-based diet. <laughs> wasn't enough then he came out with a companion cookbook and it has over a hundred recipes in it and they are beautiful and they look so delicious um i cannot wait to try some of these i just got this book um last week so i haven't had a chance to try these recipes but i'm telling you i think they're going to be delicious um every single ingredient in each recipe is health promoting so you can flip this book open and know that whatever recipe that you're preparing there's nothing in it that's going to be detrimental to your health from the knowledge that he has at this point in time which is a really cool thing to think about because sometimes you don't know what you're getting with different cookbooks and that is just so cool to know that every single ingredient is something that is going to be healthful to you and your family book not only uh, gives you all of those different recipes but it gives you a bunch of different breakfasts soups lunches uh, veggies as mains and pastas like it's one of my favorite things to have at a meal i love pasta so i'm super excited about that section uh personally and then it gets, uh, it's also got cooking guides for a variety of different grains. It tells you how to cook them on the stove and it also tells you how to cook them in a multi cooker, like an instant pot, um, the pressure, the amount of water, and all of that sort of thing um, to help you be able to better prepare grains. Because I know that sometimes some grains may be foreign to a lot of us, especially those just starting out on a whole food plant based diet. So that's really awesome to have in there as well. And then it has a section about kitchen staples. Plus, there's also a little bit of background in here um, from the How Not to Diet book that gives you a lot of information as well. So it's kind of like a quick condensed reference guide to that. Now, you'll definitely get a whole lot more information out of the regular book, but this does have some nice nuggets of information in it as well. So I highly recommend both of these books. I hope that this has been a video that you have enjoyed and that it's something that you'll check out. Like I said, I'll put all of the links in the description box below. No affiliation. It's just, I really think that these are great books and something that you needed to know about. And I was so happy to get the opportunity to share these with you. Again, a big thank you to Mary and nutritionfacts.org. If you like what you see, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It helps other people find this content that may be interested in it. And as always, thanks so much for watching.